Welcome, Achievers, to MySciences.com. This is Mr. Gary with another online lab. Today we're going to create a sundial, and this particular lab comes from the Paragon book, World of Science. Some of the supplies you will need is a protractor, a compass, ruler, vis-a-vis, -vis, pen, pencil. We're using construction paper, thick construction paper, cardstock, and a flashlight for the extension. So the first thing you want to do is figure out what latitude you are relative to the equator. Here in Winter Haven, California, we're at 33 degrees above the equator. So we use the protractor and we try to calculate where the 33 degrees are. Then we basically draw a dot, use the ruler to do a straight line because we want this uh, right triangle. Once we have the right triangle, we take our, in this case, orange paper and we use the ruler to calculate where the halfway marker is, which would be half of 11, would be 5.5. We draw a semicircle. Then we begin to label this. In order for this to work, you're going to want to point your sundial toward the south. So the 90 degree angle goes up here where you had the, uh, the edge of the compass, and then you're pointing it to the south. The creative part is getting this to stand. Some students simply bent the uh, paper and then stapled it or taped it or others just created little edges and went ahead and stapled them. So once you take it outside you point again in the direction of south and you see where the sun's shadow crosses your circle and you can do that at several intervals. One of the extensions that you can do is indoors use a flashlight to mimic the sun. Actually the sun would be in this case in this direction, rising in the east, moving across. You can talk about the fact that at high noon you wouldn't really have much of a shadow and the international date line and then daylight saving time and you could talk about uh, the fact that you have the 24 zones and uh, basically high noon is when each time zone has the sun at the highest point. So you can move the flashlight pretending that's the sun to see where your shadow is. So this is Mr. Geary for MySciences.com signing off.